there, future nurse. Now, I know I'm getting ahead of myself here, but I bet you'll like this video. And if you do, be sure to head to simplenursing.com forward slash YouTube for way more content than you can get here. And you can sign up for free. Now, switching gears to fluid volume overload, that overhydration. Clients have an overload of fluids. So just look at the O's here and think overhydration for overload. Now, the other names, this can also be called fluid volume excess, hypervolemia, and FVO, the short acronym for fluid volume overload. So clients puff up like a big old water balloon full of fluid. And naturally, this leads to big manifestations or signs and symptoms of edema, the swelling of soft tissues as a result of excess fluid accumulation. Now, although edema can affect any part of the body, it's more common and more noticeable in the lower extremities, like the legs and feet, especially toward the end of the day, because fluid pools while people maintain an upright position. So grading the pitting edema ranges from zero to four plus, making the skin look like a memory foam mattress. So please be sure to write this down. Four different textbooks say five different things, but these were the ones that were based on the NCLEX standards. So be sure to write these down. Zero plus is no pitting edema. One plus is two millimeters or less, basically mild pitting edema, and immediately rebounds for skin. Now two plus is three to four millimeters, which is considered moderate. We have a 15 second rebound of skin. And three plus is five to six millimeters. This is moderately severe. It takes about 30 seconds to rebound. And lastly, number four is the four plus, eight millimeters or deeper. This is very severe. The skin stays indented for about one to two minutes. So it doesn't rebound until after around two minutes. Now for the top four causes of edema, these are the four underlying pathophysiological processes responsible for the manifestations of edema. Looking to cut your study time in half? Head on over to simplenursing.com forward slash YouTube. You can sign up for free and get access to all of this.